What a crazy summer this has been, guys. Woo! The past 12 months have by far been the most exciting and most thrilling months of my life. And I gotta say that I started this year perfectly at my favorite place in the world, which would be Disney World. I was in Epcot for New Year's Eve night, and here's a quick snippet of my New Year's Eve. <laughs> That's a lot of fireworks. <laughs> and also the night before, I was in Magic Kingdom and they do their New Year's show on the night before New Year's Eve too, so I kinda got to do New Year's twice this year. And here's a snippet from Magic Kingdom. <laughs> fireworks all around you. So, with all those fireworks and all that craziness, that was just the perfect way to start what would become the most exciting and thrilling year of my life so far. Never in my life would I have ever imagined that I'd be going to so many parks in such a short amount of time. All the parks that I've been to this year, as I said, were Disney World, so all four parks in Disney World being Magic Kingdom, Animal Kingdom, Epcot, and Hollywood Studios. I've also been to Disneyland, been to Hershey Park, Dorney Park, King's Dominion, Knott's Berry Farm, Magic Mountain, Great Adventure, Bush Gardens, Cedar Point, Knobles, and Kennywood. And a lot of these parks were very first time parks for me. Disneyland was one of the most exciting ones for me just because I'm a big Disney nerd at heart and always will be. Some other first time parks for me were Kennywood, Knobles, Knott's Berry Farm, Magic Mountain, and Great Adventure. All of these parks just had really cool things about them that I really enjoyed. Every second of every park I went to this year, which is amazing, and I loved all of it. So sadly, the season is coming to an end. All the parks are closed during the weekdays and are only open on weekends now, which sadly that does not work well with my work schedule. I work on the weekends all the time, and so from now on, the only day I can go to a park will be on a Sunday. That being said, I'm not going to let that slow me down now. I'll be staying up to date with Hershey Park and their construction with Chocolate Town and Cannonmonium. Hershey Park's my home park, so I definitely want to stay up to date with that. So besides vlogging, I want to get into a few new ideas for some new videos. Some ideas I have will be just like reviewing coasters and parks that I've been to for this past year. While I'm vlogging in the parks, I kind of give a brief analysis of stuff that I do for the very first time. But now that I've had time to kind of digest and kind of think on a lot of these rides I've done for the first time, I feel like I can give a much more detailed and thorough analysis on a lot of these things. So I'll definitely be doing a lot of reviews one by one on coasters that I've done for the very first time, and also doing reviews for coasters that I've done all my life. Another idea I have for some new videos is something I'm going to be calling Coaster Redemptions. I'm not sure if anybody else has done this on YouTube or not. I'm sure somebody has. I haven't seen anybody, but I'm going to kind of give my own take on it, I guess. I'll be taking unpopular coasters, whether they be unpopular from the general public, or from other coaster enthusiasts, or from a little bit of both. Just taking a lot of coasters that no one likes and just turning them into something that's just mind-blowing. I'll be doing this most likely on Planet Coaster since I play Planet Coaster a lot in my free time. But, just because I'm playing Planet Coaster, I don't want this to become a gaming channel. While I might be doing some video games for some of these new videos, I just want to reiterate this is not becoming a video game channel. This is still going to be primarily a vlogging channel. I just want to keep making content and videos that are related to what I love the most, which would be theme parks and coasters. And, as you can see behind me, I play a little bit of music, I guess. I guess. And also make original music, too. So one idea I had would be making soundtracks for coasters that I've gone on this year. I don't know, just an idea that I had. I'm going to dabble around with it a little bit. Well, I think that's all that I got for right now. I just wanted to make this video real quick just to kind of recap what I've done over this past year and kind of give you guys a little preview of what's to come for the off season. And I'm super excited to be doing some of these new videos for you guys and just kind of dabble into new territory for me. But again, I just want to keep everything focused on what is my biggest passion in life, which would be roller coasters and theme parks. So we are not deviating from that topic. 
I'd also like to thank everybody who's been supportive and following me all this time, and I just really appreciate the support that you guys have given me and all the positive feedback. Just sharing all the experiences that I've done this past summer and just sharing them with you guys just makes it even more enjoyable. So if you've enjoyed everything I've done this past summer, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet, and share the channel with all your friends, family, coaster enthusiasts, and everybody else that you may possibly know. Oh. I swear that wasn't intentional. Make sure not to hit cameras. Bad. <laughs> but yeah, subscribe, like, share, all that good stuff. So my outro for all my videos this year has been right on. <laughs> I'm going to be retiring that phrase now. Only reason is because I've noticed a lot of theme parks and other coasters, they all say that at the ride or rather dispatching or rather leaving. Between that and I'm seeing a lot of other coaster enthusiasts saying that in their content as well. So I don't want to come off as I'm like stealing other people's catchphrases or something. So I'm just going to retire right on and start my own little phrase for the end of my videos now, which I'll be starting from here on out. So hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will catch you guys in the next loop.